morning. Hey. So today, first up, I've got a little bit of work to do. So I need to check emails for the restaurant. Um, see what is there. Hopefully there's not too much I have to go through because that's always a big job and always takes me a long time. Um, and then I want to design some labels for some new products that we're bringing to the store. And what else are we doing today? What else? I wouldn't mind doing a little bit of content as well. Um, I've got some posts, um, like some images and some reels to upload. Really trying to get better with my content. It's a big thing. Any content creator out there is, like does so much more work than you could ever <laughs> realize. I'm just trying to do just basic content for the restaurant and it is a big job. So I'm doing that this morning. So this morning, bit of work, get in, get it done. But all like office -y work, um, I get to be home today with my baby, which is amazing. But there is a lot of work behind the scenes of the restaurant that you can do from home, which is like so awesome. But it's such a privilege to be able to be home with him. Um, I've checked in this morning uh, with the kitchen. They're doing good. Um, checked in with the front of house team as well. They're totally on top of it. And I trust them all so much. They're just incredible at what they do. Um, we've got a big uh, table coming uh, for dinner. So that might be a little bit stressful for them. But I, I think the, the flow of bookings looks pretty good. And I think, I think they should be all right. Um, they seem relatively confident. So that's really good. But they do a really good job. They work so hard. And I'm so, so grateful to have them. Um, so, yeah, everything's under control at the restaurant. So I'm just going to get this admin stuff done. At least so they don't have to worry about it. Um, and they're like big sort of things I need to do. Hey! And then the Savi, I really want to take some time off because I'm feeling a little bit burnt out. I don't know. Like I just have been going and going and going and going and going and going. And I think I'm getting a little bit crazy with my online store. Like I'm losing my mind a little bit. Like every second of every day I'm thinking about it and every second I'm sort of working on it. So... I want to make sure I slow down and enjoy my little guy. Like he's nine months old and he's just beautiful. And like, I'm really worried that if I work too hard, I might just, I don't know, not soak in 100% of this beautiful little baby life and baby time. So I'm really going to try to take some time this RV to just, I don't know, spend with him and yeah. <sighs> Remind myself just what's really important, hey? Yeah. So that's the plan for the day, but I think we might have to start with the coffee. Do you want to start with the coffee? Hey? Maybe not coffee for you, maybe milky for you. What do you think? I love you, darling. Okay, just got the little boy preoccupied down here. He's playing with a cooling rack. I'd assume it's safe. There's no sharp corners. Um, I just give him things around the house to play with. The cat doesn't know what to think about it. The cat's the most dangerous thing in this house. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so I'm just going through emails. I can still hear that little guy down there. Um, nothing too much to deal with this morning, which is really good. So I'm just having a look. Um, I need, I've got liquor license due. So I've marked that on my list for Monday to pay because Monday we go through all our finances, pay all our bills, pay all our staff. Everything is done on Monday. Um... There's a, someone asking for um, a donation. We normally try to donate to like good causes. So I got to respond to that. Um, and we've got a, another, so an event inquiry. This is a huge event that we're doing. Um, sorry, I'm just reading it. <laughs> Great vlog content. Um, so they're just going over the menu for the events um, and asking if we can tweak the menu slightly. What they've asked for is like totally fine. We can totally do that. A lot of things we custom make. Let's check on the boy. How's he going? 
Oh, yep, he's still there. He's so beautiful. He's like the most beautiful baby ever. I want to make sure I give him plenty of time to play by himself as well. Like I was just saying, I want to give him plenty of attention, but also like I don't want to coddle him. I don't want to be a coddler, you know. I don't want to be one of those mothers that are always coddling. But also I don't want to be a neglectful mother either. I want to be somewhere in between coddling and neglect. That's my parenting aim. So, yeah, that's so easy with emails. I always build emails up to be a big thing. And I did just clear it yesterday. So there's not too many emails there. So um, he might be sick of that toy. Anyway, yeah, so there's only that one email or a few emails I need to respond to. Hey, little boy. So that's good. Easy. Let's get this done. Everything's a little bit harder with a baby, you know, but that's all right. He's fine. Are you going to let me respond to these emails? Are ya? Are you? Are you? What else can we find you to play with? There's a little toy down there. You can play with the toy. A <laughs> little bit of work this morning, darling, and then we can have the afternoon together. That's Mummy's plan. Mummy, that's my plan. Ooh. Oh, you still think you're playing with that baking sheet, do you? Hands. Wow, hands. Hands are pretty cool, hey? Just here with the little guy, um, feeding him. More like just sort of throwing all of my hard-earned food I've made on the ground for the dogs to eat. But that's all right. We're just learning, hey. You don't need to eat much of it or any of it. That's fine. That's fine. You guys are fine. So just coming back to my work, I'm nearly done. I've scheduled some content. I've, it took me longer than I thought. A piece of content I just couldn't get to upload, just kept saying error. So that was a bit like painful. So that took me longer than expected, which is just life. Everything takes longer than expected. So I'm going back to my focus here. Um, the next thing I have to do is work on some labels. So I want to do two different labels. So I've got a chili jam label. That's a new product that we're releasing into the store. So I need to do nutritional panels for it. That's the hardest thing. You've got to use this terrible website and search like the ingredients, add it to it, add the recipes, add the jars, add the jar weight, all of that sort of stuff. It's a real pain in the bottom. Um, and like you search like sugar, like if sugar's an ingredient, you'll search sugar and it'll be like, sugar-free jam or like sugar-free ice cream or this is random thing like no just sugar just sugar and then like sugar would be on like the 17th page anyway anywho so i've got to make the nutritional label see if i can get a design done up for those new um tomato jam did i say tomato jam or chili jam sometimes i say chili jam we've got both products 
Um, and I am actually doing a new label for our chili jam as well. But today I'm just focusing on the tomato jam label because otherwise it's too much and I get quite overwhelmed. Um, and also we've got little loofah soaps that we make for the store. So we grow loofahs, which are like this big, long, like zucchini, cucumbery sort of like thing. Um, dry them, peel them, and it leaves a loofah like this like fibrous sort of scrubby thing and um we sell them as like loofah loofahs that you can wash your dishes with or loofahs on a string that you can hang in your shower and use in the shower um and we also make soaps out of them so we have little loofah squares little, little loofah like circles sorry and we set them in like our shea butter soap and it's really really cool but I need to do some better labels. I've got some old cruddy labels on them. Um, I'm not happy with them. I want to get them redone. Um, I want some nice new labels on them and just like so they look a little bit more professional. Um, so those are my two label goals for the day. Everything takes time, but I really want to get all nice new labels on these products so that when we do the online store, when we post the online store it's not just a complete joke <laughs> you know like however I know not everything's going to be perfect we just need to get our products out there and but I do I do just want to see if I can get 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 it as good as I can before the launch date I want to launch it first of August I haven't told anyone this yet because in my head I'm like, first of August, first of August. But I haven't said anything in case I can't do it. However, I think I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to launch it and just be happy with what I've got. So that's the plan. Okay, let's do some labels, honey plum. Should we clean you up? Yes. <laughs> you got quite the mess. <laughs> I've changed my plan of attack. I'm going to do the green chili jam label instead. There's some information I still haven't received back from the kitchen for the tomato jam label. So I'm just going to do what I can with what I have. Um, so they're mid-service. It's 11 o'clock, so they'll be coming into lunch in the kitchen. So they don't have any time for me to call and ask them about ingredients and recipes. And Yeah, I know. It's funny. So I'm just going to see if I, I've got information to do something today. So, yeah. Okay, so ingredient to find. Sugar, apple, peel, stewed, no added sugar. Apricot, dried, stewed. No, I just want sugar. Sugar. No, I don't want anything. That, you know what I mean? Like I said sugar, you'd think sugar would be the first thing to come up. Oh, yes, of course. A fig stewed from raw, no added sugar is a more popular ingredient than just sugar. Anyway... So this is what we deal with. This is why I have the grey hairs. It's all right. It's all right. It's fine. We'll just keep searching. I'm sure it's in the list somewhere. Let's just keep searching. Must be here. Peanut butter, salted, no added sugar. No, that's not what we want. We just want sugar. Page six. Pineapple dried, sugar sweetened. That's not what we want. We just want sugar. Should come up first, shouldn't it? Sugar confectionery. Not really what we want, is it? Oh. Here we go. I found it. Sugar. I found it. Description. Purified extract from the sugar cane plant. Yes, that is what I want. We did it. We did it. Oh, Huxley. Oh, my goodness. The stress. 
Okay, so I'll see you in about 17 years and I'll have a nutritional panel for my label. Okay, I'm going to force myself to take a little bit of a break from work. I'm going to do some yoga with my baby. Look at what I've got here. Hey, gorgeous. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to force myself to take a break. It's really good having work that you love. You sort of just, you just get so obsessed and you just keep working and working and working. But I'm going to take a little bit of time to relax and, yeah, do some stretches. I always try at least once a week to stretch out everything that seizes through the week and um, yeah just spend a little bit of time with the little guy I think
So just relaxing in the kitchen now, um, had a really good day, um, a productive morning. Um, I think my mind, I'm getting a little bit overwhelmed with everything that needs to be done with the online store and content and marketing calendars and I, I'm getting very overwhelmed with and like shipping and everything, but I just need to keep focusing. This is what I've got on my fridge here. It's my planning system. What is the next right step? That's something I'm implementing and I think it's going to really benefit my brain because I get so far ahead of myself and then I get overwhelmed and I can't cope. <laughs> so what is the next right step? But beautiful day, relaxing afternoon. Like I got to do some little yoga with the, yoga with the little guy and then, um, you know, we played in the nursery, read a book and, you know, then we did the laundry, had a shower and, um, yeah, we're now just doing a little bit of evening routine, like just um, got some cashews, some maple cashews on and just enjoying my time in the kitchen. I think that's really restorative for me and I think it's important just to know what's restorative for you. Everyone's so different and like all I wanted to do was light a candle and just mess around in my kitchen, you know, watch a YouTube, make myself a drink and just enjoy myself and I've loved it. Yeah, so few more things, just got to get his dinner ready, feed sour the sourdough starter. Um, yeah, beautiful, beautiful day. Really, really happy with what we've achieved today. Yes. <laughs> what we've achieved, you've helped me. <laughs> but yeah, just going to get a nice early night to bed tonight. Tomorrow, heading into the restaurant. Um, yeah, and I'm going to get my hands on, hands on. I don't know, that's a strange thing to say, isn't it? But, like, get into a shift, you know, good old-fashioned barista or a bar shift. And, um, yeah, catch up with the team. So that's the plan tomorrow. But early night tonight, so I can get up early, get him dressed and ready, get him dropped off at grandma's, get myself organized. Um, so tonight, packing lunches, getting clothes ready, everything, just, like, setting up. So tomorrow is nice and easy. But it is the most beautiful afternoon. Let me show you out this window. It is just stunning. The clouds in the sky, like I don't know if it's like a bit stormy or something out there. Maybe not. Mm, anyway, it's just stunning. I'm really enjoying it. <laughs> so nice. <laughs>